So Caitlin's always asking me slash telling me when's the truck going to be done or how much longer are you going to be working on it? So I kind of take that two different ways. One way being she's excited to see it done so we can drive it. And two, when's it going to be done because of how long it's been sitting here and how much money we're spending on it. So, so today I took apart all the links and everything, front cross member, rear cross member, and all these link bars. We're taking them to get painted today and we don't have a truck. I could find somebody's truck to use or one of my parents or her parents or whatever, but she said, well, Derek, let's just put them in my SUV. So I guess that means she's uh, into the truck if she wants me to load up all these link bars and whatnot in to the man van. So she put down the seats for us. We loaded them up, quite a bit of weight in there. But uh, I gotta appreciate that because if it wasn't for the man van or her, we wouldn't be going to get these painted. Yeah, we would, but I'm gonna make her feel included. I would have put the seats down in my car and laid the front seat down as flat as it can and ran them from the trunk all the way up to the front seat if I have to. Whatever I gotta do to get these bars painted, I'll do. Are we taking truck parts to get painted, Snuggum? Yes, but right to Jonah's house. So now that we have all the welding done, everything that I can think of anyway, we got tabs inside the buckets. They're all welded. Obviously seeing all the link bars, they're done since they're off for paint. These tabs in here are done. Uh, we added these gussets here. Thought it'd be a cool idea to put the Canadian flag somewhere on it. So got them all mounted up there. That just made the front cross member a lot sturdier than what it was just because the front's a weld on one where the rear is a bolt on it was just easier to weld this one as you can't get in behind here basically in behind the frame there's too much stuff going on so it's just easier to weld them we're gonna do a little bit of painting today nice day outside today so paint won't take too long to dry and just keep going so here in this shop and a lot of other places that I do work on and places I just normally work. Everything's about safety, right? As you guys know. So since we're going to be doing some painting, I got my respirator on here. They work very well. Here's the paint I'm going to be using for the frame and the buckets and whatnot. It's VHT. So that means very high truck. As you all know, it's going to be sitting around 18 to 20 inches of lift. So this would be the paint that you're shopping for if you have this size of truck. If you have a lower truck, this paint will not work. It'll just flake off within two days. Camera action, living in a dream, now my music, they be... Well, I